But you need what? to number them from one. You see very small, right? Just kidding. I can see. <laughs> but just let me know. I can, I'm so, hey, Mr. Watson told us about this field trip on the first day of class, so I knew about it. But Tom was asking me about that, right? Well done. So now we need to rearrange them in the correct order. So what is the first, ah, first thing of an email? Hello, Tom. Well done. The greeting. Oh, what's wrong? Silly ink. I choose black. There, better. <laughs> ah, much there better. Well second done. one. Good job. This, so now this second... one is going to be the definitely last one. So there. Well done. One, two, so how... three, four, five, six, seven. So it is what's the number seven? Good job, because that is what's Just in case. Her. <laughs> Good job. Okay, then it says... Mr. Hello, Tom. Mr. Watson. So that, I think that this one is the second one. That is correct. Good job. Okay, this one's the third one. Ooh, are you sure that one is the third one? Let me just see first. Okay. Okay. I'll give you a hint. I don't think that one is the third one. Because we talked about games, do you remember? Games, but games are the last one. This one is the number five. Okay, are you sure that it's the last one? Let's take a look quickly. So, let's see. Okay, I got it. You can move now. <laughs> okay, let's see. Hmm. Okay. So, I think so that one would be... Right here. There so we go. The, um, five. Oh, are you sure? But there are one, two, three, four, no, five. This one is five. This one is what you're going to choose. But are you sure this one is the one? Okay, let's see. Because yes, yeah, it is. No, because? iPad for the game. And then you said you have to ask Tom to bring. Uh... So do you see? The snacks comes after the iPad. Does that make sense? <laughs> okay, but well done. You're still doing great. So that would be number five, and the one at the bottom, which is G, would be number four. Okay, sorry B, I have to erase you from your camp. <laughs> you're not allowed to be here. And five, you're not allowed to be in number four's camp. There we go, Susie. You are too clever, sweetheart. Hey. So bad. There we go. Do you know Shuri? Yes, I don't have a lesson with her today. I know. Last time I just teach her grammar. It was like yesterday. Oh. I see. I wonder why she wasn't in today. Hmm. Maybe she had a class yesterday. Um, <laughs> because you are my teacher, not hers. Oh, I see. <laughs> okay, so here are some stickers. Yeah. Let's go, to Space Bunny. Okay. Here I come. Yes, you wait, Lucy. I'll get some Space Buns. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe next time you can have Space Buns as well. Now, let's see. Writing part two. Write an article. Wow, that's quite interesting. It says, vocabulary focus, summer project. Okay, so let's see. Can you say these words for teachers? Let's start off Science with Science project, DEY -D crafts project, art project, environmental project. Ooh, I know all of these. I know. So can you give teacher one example of a science project? A science project is where we make cool things and show and show it with everyone and introduce how we do it so everyone can learn more about science. Oh, good job! A lot of your YouTube videos are about that, so well done. Then we have I DIY feel. craft project. <laughs> oh, I know DIY, DIY craft project means that we have to do it ourselves. We don't need to buy it. We have to oh, use God. the materials that we have. Right? Well done. And an art. That is correct. I'm so proud of you. An art project? An art project. A crafts project means yes. that like we're making something, we fold things. But art is like we draw, we paint, or we make some creative pictures. An environmental project means that we have to plant trees and save the environment and teach everyone, stop throwing trash everywhere, and be kind to nature. Well done. So like recycling, is that correct? Mm-hmm. And well reduce. Okay, so can you think oh, and reduce and reuse. Yeah. Well done. Good job. Okay, so can you mention maybe one extra summer project that you can think of that is not mentioned? Oh, I love science project. It's my favorite. Okay, so is that your favorite one? Well done. Okay, I will take that as an answer. Good job. I was about to ask you which one would you prefer. So you would prefer a science project, correct? So I have done many projects.
projects and my friends. So if I write an article, like, it's like a book, right? Well, it's in a newspaper or in a magazine, so it wouldn't really matter. Oh, so it would not really matter. So, so my favorite science project, my favorite project is science project. I can learn a lot of things about it. And there has been a lot of people who joined a science fair last year, and they all won first prize. My in my in my class, there's a friend who who won second prize in making a robot. Oh, that's cool. I like it. Ooh, that is actually quite cool. I wish I could build a robot. But well done. I like that article. Okay, are you ready for the next part? Mm -hmm. Yes, let's go. You're doing fantastic. So let's see. This one, it says writing practice, part two. So, you see. Okay, so let me make my own article. Okay. Do you want to do your own one? Okay, but before we do that, let's quickly just see what do we have here, okay? So this one says, you see this notice on the English language website. Articles wanted, summer projects. So there it says, what kind of summer projects do you enjoy? Do you prefer to work on your projects alone or with friends and why? Write an article answering these questions and we will put it on our website. Write an article or your article so, in about 100 words. So I'll just say that say there are many types of summer projects. Most, most, most types of projects are mostly for boys, like outdoor activities, and most girls would want to stay inside. But personally, I would like to enjoy the activities outside. I, okay, well done. I always feel very confident when I make my own things and teach everyone about, about science, and I prefer to work with my friends in a group because I can chat about all the things, and it's a lot better if I use some dangerous sharp things, right? Ooh, okay. I, I could I could build a volcano that will explode out of lava. Well, that might be really interesting for everyone who wants to learn science. That is not bad. Well done. Okay, okay. so she's just going to ask you some questions. Okay, when you're done. I'm not done. Okay, go ahead. Once you're done, I will ask you some questions. So go okay, blah, 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 blah. Done. <laughs> okay, but that was a very good one. So do you understand how we write an article? Okay, have you ever actually written an article before? Well, this is my first time. Ooh. Okay, so teacher wants to try and see, can you try and write your 